hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you more tips on using Descript and the main topic for today is to use this Descript text-to-speech function so what text-to-speech is is what you can do is just type in a bunch of words sentence paragraphs whatever and then it'll help you generate a voice for you and you know the traditional traditional you know the traditional google translate when you press on the pronunciation on those words it sounds really robotic it doesn't sound good at all but then days have changed with all the ai machine learning the voice generation has been really good uh, i think on the top of these machine learnings it's either from microsoft azure aws ibm watson's google cloud so these are the main main players and i don't know which one the Descript actually use it might be their own but then the the voice of those Descript uh, stock files actually sound quite good and then it's free of charge. Obviously, you can pay for the, the, the premium version of the other text-to-speech software to get the really good uh, pronunciation of those words. But let's give this one a try. So I'm going to jump into my Descript program. If you don't have a Descript program yet, uh, I will leave a link down in the description so you can sign up for free. Uh, it's free. So there's a free there's a free tier to use so it doesn't it doesn't, doesn't cost you anything you don't have to put in your credit card any anything at all so even right now i'm also using the free free plan so all you have to do is just come in here create a new project i've already created one so i'm just going to jump in here so the way that it works is you just have to type in the words that you want to allow a script to pronounce so let's just let's try Hello, my name is William. You'll need to be really good with the typing, uh, the, the, the spelling, because whatever you type, it'll try to uh, pronounce for you. So I'm going to put in welcome, William. Uh, hello, my name is William. Welcome to my channel. So on the left hand side, you can choose which stop voice you want to use. So for example, they've got the voice for Dom, Emily. So you just have to play the one that you think it's good. So I'm going to play Dawn. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. And if things... So that, that voice really sound like some sort of movie trailer. And then let's try Emily. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. And if things don't work out, just take another shot. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. And if things don't work out, just take another shot. So let's try roof now. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. Now let's give Malcolm a try. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. And if they Yeah, that sounds pretty good as well. Let's give Ethan a try. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Develop from the negatives. And if things don't work out, just take another shot. Life is like a... Okay, let's give Henry a try. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important, capture the good times, develop from the negatives, and if things don't work out, just take another shot. Now let's give Nancy a try. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important, capture the good times, develop from the negatives, and if things don't work out, just take another shot. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important, capture the good times, develop from the negatives, and if things don't work out, just take another shot. And that was the last one from Nicholas. So depend on the one you like, I personally don't like, I do like the one for Ethan. So I'm going to use Ethan. So every time you'll see Ethan's name here and there are different tones that you can choose in these scripts. So in here you choose Ethan and then you can see there are different tones. So ethan's voice are pretty formal so there's like formal one formal two formal three formal four so yeah again try it out once more urban raccoons are now demonstrably better at problem solving than their country and then let's try out formal two 
They need to preen their flight feathers, clean off the city dust, and cool themselves down. But death lies in wait. In the no, last 6,000 years, the surface of our planet has undergone a sudden change. A new habitat has appeared, entirely designed and constructed by one species for its own purpose. So you get my point. So choose choose the stock voice and then choose the tone that you like. So I'm going to go with form of three. And I'm going to stop the video and I'll just type in a bunch of words to generate these voices for you. All right, I'm back. I've typed out a bunch of words, sort of a fake conversation between Ethan and Emily. So let's give this a try. So either you hit the play button here by pressing the space, or if you use Windows, just use alternate and then the left key. So let's say start here. Hello, my name is Ethan, one of the stock voice in Descript. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm interviewing a very special guest. Her name is Emily and she is also one of the stock voice in Descript. Hello, Emily. Hi, Ethan. Thanks for having me on your channel. It's a pleasure to be on your show. So, so what do you think? I think the sound is not as perfect as the, the more premium text-to-speech software, but I think it does a pretty good job. And as I pretty previously mentioned, you can choose the tone that you'd like. So the different tones that Ethan has, the different tones that Emily has. So they, again, they're using like formal voices. So this is what you can do, but then you can also create your own voice. So you can become one of the Ethan or one of the Emily. I think you just need to upload like a few hours of your voice and then it'll help you generate uh, the text for you. I think this is called overdub in, in their software. So this is how that really works. So if you want these to be inside a video, so something is pretty cool. I'll, I can show you here. So if you just go on to the, the first sentence and then you use uh, waveform. So I think in, in a lot of videos you see there's words, you know, talking and I'm going to show you right here. So Hello, if you my name talking, is Ethan, one of the stock uh, voice in description. These waveforms start, you know, popping up. And then if you want to choose you know, different colors, different things, you can just play around here. So I do like cyan and then the uh, magnitude you can choose. So it, it, it looks really dramatic when, when it starts going up and down. So let's give that a try. Voice and Descript. Welcome to my channel. Yeah, and then you can see if you don't like line, you can use circle. Today, I'm interviewing a very special guest. Her name very is Emily. So and let, she me, let me just drag this out all the way to the end. And then let's make this a bit bigger special guest. Her name is Emily and she is also one of the stock so voices. So this is circle. If you don't like circle, then you can choose something else. Maybe wave. And descript. Hello, Emily. Hi, Ethan. Thanks for having me on your channel. It's a pleasure to be on your show. All right. So I think I'll, I'll go with line. I do like line. And then I'll just spread this out to the end of the video. I'll put shadow on. And then I'll just make it at the bottom. So that's how you create the wave clip. Another feature you can use is actually just put out the actual text. So I think these are quite common in Instagram doing like a really short, a short video with people talking. Uh, if you do like a, a podcast then you can, you can short, shorten it into a, a story and then just to give out some punchlines. So I think the tool is called fancy caption. So I'll just hit the fancy caption here. And I want this to be on top. I'm just going to change the layout so I can see the actual timeline. Whoops. Okay. Let's match it here. And then spread this out all the way to the end. So it'll just show you the, the transcript, the words, live text, 
and we want to I mean if you want to change the fonts uh, I'm not going to change it I'm just going to show you how this works I'll just put it in right in the middle and then I think there's a pretty cool thing you can use it's the yeah the word level animation so the words that has been spoken already it could be in some corner and then the words that hasn't been spoken it's sort of transparent so let's just give this a play and see special guest her name is emily and she is also one of the stock voice in descript hello emily hi ethan thanks for having me on your channel so if you want different colors for different people then you can you can chop this up uh you know, maybe ethan could be green and then emily could be something else so you kind of get the idea how this works no it's a pleasure to be on your show all right so what else could we add on top of the on top of this video so we've got the fancy caption we've got the waveform you can also do a progress bar so a lot of the videos that you see online there's a progress bar you know are we in the middle of the the clip or we're we just at the the end again it, it places on top and then the color again you can choose what color you want transparency color then you can make it the transparency you want so that's pretty good so let's give this clip a play so once you start playing this progress bar moves, you've got the waveform, you've got the you know the live capturing going on. So that you can you can you you can use this for a lot of different things, and this is just one of them. So yeah, that's pretty much it. How the text to speech works in in Descript. So once you're finished, all you have to do is just export it. Uh, you want to export to to your own computer through YouTube audiogram. Um, the file that you want to export. So in this case, it's video. I'm going to choose video, and then just choose the the file size, etc., and then hit export. And that's all. That's all you have to do. so the free tier is only only able to export 720p so if you have a paid version you can use the 1080p i think i think you can get the 1080p or the 4k if you're as a if you're using the paid version so this concludes my video for Descript on how to use ai ai text to speech generator and i hope this was useful and please do give me a like if you think this was good. Uh, subscribe to my channels and you can catch me more in the next video. Thank you.